Hi there, so like everyone else who buys a Phantom, you buy it and you get hooked and it's awesome and you want to be get better gear. And so I got the Futaba THJ transmitter and it's really awesome and it's confusing as hell. But uh, fortunately I went online and I found the videos on YouTube by that HPI guy, aka Richard Whelan, and they're awesome and they had me set up in no time. However, I'm getting a new gimbal and it has roll capability and so I want to open up my channel 8, which is being used by the D-Switch. Uh, the AV2 is also what it's called. So um, anyhow, I went went around, fudged around, and I figured out a way to, to still use the D-switch to enable failsafe and uh, freeze up the Channel 8 AV2. And um, it also still allows you to use the GPS, ATI, and manual mode without having to set the bottom thing to failsafe. So let me show you how I did it. Uh, first thing I did was I went to the aux channels and I changed Channel 8 to null. Uh, previously it was using the D-switch, but now it's set to null. And so now it's no longer being used. Uh, then I went into the P-mix. As you can see in channels, in the curve 6, it's now AVI into AVI. And I'll show you the curve setting that I used. Uh, P5 is set to negative 45. P4 is 0. P3 is negative 45. P2 is 0. And P1 is negative 45. And the mix, well right now it's off, but now it's on. Um, so you can see the master is now set to AV1, slave is set to AV1, switch is still switch D, and the position is still down. And that's pretty much it. And now it'll still use failsafe with the, the D switch, and um, it frees up my channel 8 and AV2 for more fun. Thanks a lot.